Okay guys, this is my third attempt at this Aldi haul video, so I'm gonna try to go quickly because I'm starving and I really wanna eat. Um, okay, I went to the grocery store today. I spent about $120, which is more, more than I normally do, um, but I've been out of town so nobody went grocery shopping, so it is a little bit bigger and there are some things in here that I normally would not have picked up, but like I said, I'm starving, so let's get into it. I have some frozen strawberries for smoothies, some chicken stock, just because I like to have it on hand. I have, these are two things that I normally wouldn't have purchased. I have uh, mini chicken egg rolls and um, little crab rangoons. I'm making stir fry this week for dinner, so I thought these would be fun to go with them, especially since the kids aren't huge fans of it. Um, some ravioli, these are for the kids I babysit. Uh, some four cans of corn, some mixed nuts. This is a really great value. It's like $11 for this giant thing and it has Brazil nuts and hazelnuts, which I love. Uh, some honey roasted peanuts, I'm trying to get some snacky things that aren't junk food for me. Um, that's like Lucky Charms. I normally don't buy that, but my kids have been begging for weeks and weeks and weeks and weeks and I keep saying next time, next time, so I had to get it. Um, this one over here, I can't actually reach it. I'm leaning across my table. This one is like um, Apple Jacks or like Apple Cinnamon Cheerio things. So I was excited to try it. It was literally the last box and that's why it's all mangled up. These yogurts, my son will not eat yogurt out of a cup very often, but he likes that in the little squeeze tube things. This is a new flavor, Wacky Watermelon and Cherry Cherry. I like this um, brand because there's no artificial colors or anything. Um, you tripped. Are you okay? Oh my goodness, are you okay? No. Oh, I think you are. I need a white cup. <laughs> she said she needs an ice pack because she tripped, but she's fine, I promise. Um, I have popcorn. We always have that on hand. Pizzas for the kids that I babysit. They're so picky. They eat hardly anything, so I... I feed them what I can get them to eat. Sometimes they just won't eat all day um, because they're that stubborn. But uh, organic apple juice, some trash bags, organic apples, um, almond milk for my smoothies, half and half for coffee, some cinnamon rolls for breakfast, some cheese puffs. I want some yogurt, I want you. I want you. Can you say hello? Yogurt, I want you. Hey, how about you smile pretty and say hi to the camera? Hi, Cameron. <laughs> Cameron. Camera. Camera. My camera that I'm holding. Spinach for my smoothies. Um, Cameron. Tater tots. I don't know if they'll, the kids will eat these or not, but I grabbed them. Here's that Cameron. stir fry I was telling you about. Um, Mommy, who's Cameron? I said camera, not Cameron. Um, this is the stir fry I was telling you about. It's really, I like the quality of this. It's got a lot of different vegetables in it. It has a sauce packet, but you can throw that away and make your own sauce. Or you can use it, whatever. Um, split peas. I really like split pea soup, but I've never seen these there, so I'm excited. If you can be quiet while I finish this, okay? Because Mommy really doesn't want to start over again. <laughs> this is agave um, for smoothies. Broccoli, potatoes. I've got turkey bacon, turkey hot dogs, and a package of just regular turkey lunch meat under there. Two packages of peppers. Um, I have meatballs in the freezer that I'm going to be making like hoagies and peppers and Italian meatballs. Uh, green beans, blueberries, and strawberries. Carrots, a package of chicken, a package of string cheese, some, some sausage for breakfast, some onions, this um, seafood salad dip with crackers, which is what I'm about to eat when I get done with this. I'm starving! Some, these are the hoagie rolls for the, um, what I was telling you about. Uh, the fresh ravioli. I always get if they have it on my list or not because they don't always have it and it's always, always, always so good. So these are two that I've never tried so I'm really excited. This one's spinach, mushroom, and gruyere. I love gruyere. And this one is goat cheese, roasted tomato, ravioli, and I love goat cheese. So I'm very excited to try those. I think they're going to be delicious and I cannot wait. And um, this quinoa pouch, she always, Ari always gets these little pouchy things. Um, I don't know if I showed you these, but these are um, peanut butter stuffed pretzels. Logan really likes those, so I got those for him. I think that's everything. If it's not, oh well, you'll have to I don't even know. <laughs> that's all I got for today. I have to go eat. I will show you a meal plan later, um, but yeah, I'm starving. I'm going to go eat. All right, bye. Okay, everybody, here is the uh, meal plan for the week. We have 
um, steak, broccoli, and potatoes, either mashed or baked or whatever. Um, we're going to have stir fry. We're going to have corn chowder. We're going to have um, bacon and goat cheese pierogies. And we're going to have Italian meatball subs with the peppers. And that is the meal plan for the week. It's taken me actually like a couple days to get this posted because I just didn't have the meal plan actually written out. So um, yeah, that's it for the week. And I look forward to seeing you in my next one.